Hello everyone and welcome to Rhino Gold Training Level 1. In this video we're going to see how we can use a hand drawing to create a 3D object. Well, let's see for an example. I'm going to click here and place image 1 1 and select my image that I've got here. I'm going to come for a moment here to go to center to place my image here in center and now carry on with this kind of tools that allows us to work at the same time with this. We can lock the picture, we can add a move out now. Okay, we can change the transparency like this. Okay, it's very useful because when we're going to draw lines, okay, we could see them better when we are working like this, okay. I'm going to take this image again, go to center like this and I'm going to lock it. Last we're going to talk about this drawing. Okay, we're going to see them after. Well, so let's start. We can use of course our normal drawing tools that we already know for work with it. For example, I'm going to take a snap off like this and we can carry on working Oh, I place the arc better here from the end like this okay and carry on doing it like this okay and we just go carry on doing that here also the same like this place an arc here we could reflect it by symmetry here but well I prefer just to end it if I've started doing like this so this is what we get like this I'm going to join them all like this, okay. You can offset these curves inside like this, for example. And let's change a view to this and put it a bit up like this. Now we can make a loft between this and this curves. And here I will say that I want it from just this point already like this okay and here I want to cap it with planner like this and here we have it okay we also can carry on drawing this and it was a small example for you could see how can we work with our bitmap placed down using our place image one one tool Let me explain you a detail. If we drag and drop our image, as you know, we can modify the transparency, we can lock it, okay? And let me explain you about draw and the hardness, okay? By default, okay, we can use draw and use the mouse or use a tablet Wacom or whatever. And the idea is we can draw by hand, okay? After we finish our line, as you can see here, it's not too much good. When we finish, automatically smooth the line, okay? It depends on the hardness, okay? If our hardness is higher, okay, the result is more precise to the original curve, okay? Then this is great, for example, come here and I draw like that okay I finish great great this tool is great if you use a tablet okay and remember that you can 
select these objects and edit the control points okay as you want okay well that's all thanks for watching